Welcome to Kinta's Point of Sale. Let's get started. In this video, we will explore the Z-Reading features of the system. Before proceeding, please make sure that your inventory has been populated with data. As there are similarities with the X-Reading module, we will focus on the differences and what the Z-Reading feature has to offer. Like the X-Reading, the Z-Reading can also be found in the Reports page. Here you already have a visible difference. Let's open a second tab showing the X reading to compare. In X reading, the report breakdown is a summary for the specific date chosen. In Z reading, you choose a starting date and an end date. While the X reading is a daily report, Z reading accumulates the result of the chosen dates. This gives the user a wider perspective. Let's enter a start date plus an end date to generate a report. Similar to the X reading form, you can filter by choosing a cashier and terminal number. Now, let's go to the Z reading view page. While the page shows results from the chosen dates, here you have the option to change them so you don't have to reload the previous page. Another option lets you add a categorized item list below. Here is the added table. Scroll down to find the print button. Click print to view the print settings. Then click print when ready. Alternatively, if you are using Google Chrome, you can save this into a PDF file. Click change, and select save as PDF. Then click save. Going back to the main Z reading page, here are some few reminders. The EOD print button is a shortcut for printing any reports loaded on this page. Similar to X reading, you can generate reports based on detailed sales, sales summary, and item quantity. You can add cash denominations as well as download Excel reports. For more information on these modules, please review the X reading training video. Thank you for watching.